What is going on guys, so we're in the car, gear is loaded up and we are ready to rock and roll. Heading down to Oklahoma, it's a long old drive. So we're leaving early, sun's just cracking up over the back of the houses here. We've got a solid day of driving and then some. So 21 hours, 30 minute drive all the way down. 1,400 miles one way to go and see the, the guys down at Big Cop Tackle, the center of all carpiness in the US. Big Cop Tackle pretty much supplies majority of the, the gear in the US to the anglers that are just getting into it but also the guys that have obviously been here a very long time they've been open and running many many years uh, at least since i've been in the us so well over 15 years now awesome to work with and obviously uh, give us the the best of the best products that are available and get them over here and and obviously uh, get them shipped to us so we would take some time out uh, we've got a couple of weeks uh, here in march while it's cold where i am in connecticut down there it's starting to warm up so we are bringing the gear with us going to do a little bit of fishing as well and hopefully cross off a couple of fish that i've been trying to catch for for a while just not been able to so yeah off we go going on guys so it's uh late oh it's getting late anyway been on the road for i don't know now uh a long time 708 miles so far um so just a little over a little over halfway i just stopped to grab some food so I'm gonna get that down me get back on the road do about another four hours and then I'm going to try and pull off onto a lake a try out for a couple hours just get some rest um, throw a rod out throw a rod or two out and uh, see what happens so yeah we'll go from there and uh, hopefully might get a fish on the way through don't know if not no biggie um, anyway catch up with you soon
It's the first buff of the trip here in Oklahoma. And uh, I'm lucky enough to get this as my very first buffalo ever. Managed to make the drive out. 1500 miles for a fish like this. I think it's well worth it. So I'm gonna get this one back and uh, hopefully be able to get another one. What a fantastic fish. Breaks my current overall PB in the US at 48 pounds. I'm absolutely blown away. It's just unreal. There it is. Absolute tank. <laughs> Again, that first one I had was unreal, but this is definitely a little bit bigger than the last one, and uh, to drive all this way with a result like this, it's absolutely fantastic. Woo! Alright baby, off you go. So as some of you know, I've been here um, at Big Cop Tackle for the uh, well, the best part of two weeks now. And to say it's been an eye opener would be a little bit of an understatement. Figured I'd take a moment out to walk you through the store, show you some some of the products that are here in the store. And there's so many to list and show you, but I figured it'd be a good time now while it's quiet and there's not too much going on to just go over but some of them that are here in the store. So um, yeah, I won't go too far over this side because as you can see, lights are off. So yeah, um, basically Fox, Hutchinson products on this side, all your flavors, particles, um, you know, all the good stuff. <laughs> um, so you've got all the Nash products, it comes down here into the TA products, um, NTG, ESP, and then all the way down the end is the Gardener. Actually not all the way down the end, Gardener has almost 10 feet there. Uh, over to this side on the end cap here, all the Christon products. Sticky, if any of you are sticky fans out there, plenty of that to go around. Bunch of different alarms that are available. More NTG. I'm surprising this stuff is actually really good. A um, lot of really good products there for the budget uh, angler or someone that's just getting into it. So if you are looking through the website, take a look on that section and the NTG stuff. Definitely something there for everyone. Uh, followed up by some of my personal favorite enterprise um, corn. Eternal range, basically. It's all um, a rubber Im imitation corn and maize for those of you that aren't aware. Some of it is UV, so it will glow at night. Others are just high vis, and some of them are even flavored, which is uh, really awesome. As I said, behind me here, all the Gardener products. Um, again, huge range, everything you need. And then in this section here, it's basically all the all your different LEDs and, and method feeders in these racks right here. Uh, it's pretty much something there for everyone, uh, whether it be from you know ounces, single ounce, right up to uh, the big tractor LEDs that uh, even that Nash do, uh, very heavy LEDs. Um, right over here to Hinder's Baits, um, all the Tigers, all the different flavoured uh, infused particles, uh, right down to French Mix particles, Crushed Tigers, one of my favourites, do it in the smaller bags and the big bags are up top. On this side of the store, you've got some of the Gamakatsu stuff, the G-Sharp hooks, Jags, Jags stuff's up there as well. I've got a couple of files, if you, if you need to sharpen your hooks, they are the files to get. I'm gonna change hands here. This camera's getting heavy. Whew. Down to here, something that I'm gonna be using this summer going forwards, partnership that I've just established through Big Carp is with PB Products. Something that I've used off and on over the years, but this year going forwards, I'm luckily enough to be trying some of that stuff out. So everything there, all end tackle, but hooks, hook link, quick links, uh, leg clip, right through the whole range. They even do some really cool um, baiting needles uh, with a stripper tool on the end, but I'll be doing a few videos in the coming months to show you guys more about that range. So yeah, I'll be here tomorrow morning and then I'll be uh, getting getting ready to head out tomorrow afternoon uh, for a long 1500 mile drive back. But it's been a great experience, great time here with the guys, working with Jake in uh, packing orders in here and uh, chatting with, with Zach and Dave, you know, as you do over the carpy goings on in the world. And this is their office area. Um, as you can see, it looks like a lot going on. And then this backdrop, I'm sure some of you are quite familiar with, the lives that they do on uh, on Facebook, their Facebook lives. So tune into those. Um, 
you're missing out if you don't and then over to this area it's all your bulk baits so um coming down here see so see more stuff munch baits they've got a bunch a bunch of different stuff on a munch bait all the pop-ups and dips and liquids some of my favorites uh, i've been using since last year which i've done very well on one of my special favorites are the pb dna pop-ups i use a number of their other products as you can see there is quite a lot of hook bait varieties available so the old uh, pineapple banana this liquid is is real good give it a go if you get a chance but there's a number of different pop-ups there in the range and then that goes through to stick mixes, boilies, beater stem pellets as well. And then on this side, you've got all the main line mixes, more boilies, bulk boilies as well. So these big five kilo bulk deals that, I know that a lot of you guys have been picking up. And then for main line fans, double aisle. So yeah, um, all your particles, high impact ground bait, pellet, base mix. Something for everyone. Again, more pellets all the way down, bomb mixes, hemp tigers more power particles all pva friendly um oh this is uh, this is the kitchen here at big carp tackle for those of you that have never seen it lovely little area where all the coffee and tea gets made and then uh going back up this side uh you got dave's special little refrigerator here with some uh couple of adult beverages in and then the, all the hook baits and flavorings for the mainline stuff as well going all the way up so that's pretty much it guys um it's been a great time really had a, a lovely experience being here and spending some time with with dave and zach and jake here in the store and uh, learning all about it and uh seeing exactly what goes on from a day-to-day -day perspective and it really is quite an eye-opener with just exactly how much goes on uh, you know all the work that goes into it so um for those of you you know that are interested in or you're just starting to carp fish this is the place to come and if you're unsure reach out to them send them an email hey can you help me i'm looking to find this or what rod do you think will work best with this and they're always willing to help you out and answer any questions you might have as well so yeah uh that's pretty much it for me I've, like i said i'm heading out tomorrow and uh might even stop off and fish somewhere on the way home 1500 miles it's a long way.